Hello everyone, and welcome to my Sister Wives 4E channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. After the tragic loss of the Brown family, Christine Brown, star of Sister Wives, has been leading a happy life. The 52-year-old enjoys taking some of her children along on outdoor excursions and sharing her healthy lifestyle. It also seems that after their post, David and Christine Woolley have another journey planned. See Christine demonstrating her new, sultry toy by continuing to read. How is Christine Brown doing today, Sister Wives? For the past few months, Christine has been journaling about her menopause. The Sister Wives actress even collaborated with Janelle, Maddie, and Mike Kelty to start a social media platform dedicated to healthy living, where they offer advice on gut health and weight loss. Following the terrible death of Garrison Brown, Cody Brown's former third wife has not yet disclosed if they plan to return to the reality show. Many, nevertheless, are relieved that Christine and her ex-sister spouses have been making an effort to maintain their happiness and optimism. Many were taken aback when she revealed her new sexy toy to David Woolley. Christine displays her hot new toy. Christine shared lovely pictures of her new erotic toy with David Woolley on Instagram. The Sister Wise actress claims that they have just re-wrapped their black RZR. Take a look at our new hot RZR. I'm grateful to it act customs for fantastic rap. We had a great time getting her all messy and embarking on her first adventure. The RZR that the couple utilized on their May 2023 escapades in Utah with Janelle and Savannah may be familiar to fans. Their upcoming major journey is still unknown to each other. However, David Woolley previously disclosed that visitors to their bed and breakfast might catch him out and about in the RZR with Christine Brown. Those who were thrilled with the way their RZR looked also left the two with encouraging remarks. How is the business of Christine Brown and David Woolley doing, Sister Wives? Christine has been managing her B&B &B in Utah with great care. The Sister Wives actress said earlier this month that June is a stunning time to visit Moab and that their B&B &B would be the ideal spot to stay. The reality TV star continued, Our Moab home is a beautiful retreat where you can truly rest and feel are right skeptical about how the upcoming Sister Wives seasons will function in the wake of Garrison Brown's passing. Some fans are sure that they won't watch, but others hope that the tragic death of a Brown family member will lead to something good. The Prospects for Sister Wives Prior to Garrison Brown's passing, it appears that Sister Wives season 19 filming was already underway. Given that they have moved forward with the production, it seems that the Brown story will continue. Some fans, though, are concerned about the way TLC will structure the series. Now that Garrison is dead, some people think it would be torturous to watch, while others want to see as much as possible. There are also a lot of talks regarding how the show should proceed in the future. Notably, a few fans believe that the three spouses who separated from Cody Brown should be the main focus of the narrative. Some believe that honoring Garrison's memory and preventing suicide should be prioritized. Supporters talk about possibly good Sister Wives spin-offs. Some Sister Wives fans started a discussion of the possibility of spin-off series on Reddit. They begin by introducing themselves as Plaglet Life, then briefly describe what a potential spin-off involving the Brown kids might entail. Would you be in favor of them finishing up Southwest and doing a spin-off a la counting on with just the consenting adult kids? Which cast members would you choose? The Reddit commenter also thinks it relieves the Brown family on Sister Wise as a whole. It might also provide TLC the ability to revoke Cody and Robin Brown's contracts. Additionally, the user believed it would be simple to include visits from some of the moms, Mary, Janelle, and Christine Brown, giving families the choice to participate if they so want, while keeping those who choose not to. To illustrate, the user provides their dream cast lineup, which consists of Gwen, Leon, Maddie, Gabe McKelty, and Bologna Payton. On Reddit, not everyone believes that Sister Wives could benefit from a spin-off starring brown kids. The issue with that is that Mike Kelty and Maddie are both parents. 
Do we wish to take advantage of future generations? Not at all, other than Tony and McKelty, who would do that. What a horrible concept, lol. Not at all. I believe that the children should be allowed to live their own lives. If they were to make a spin-off, I would like to see a rewatch where they reveal their true narrative, whatever that may be. They don't have to give it to us, but it would be interesting to know what they invented and which sections of Sister Wise are based on actual events. Many fans might find it therapeutic, and I'm just curious about that aspect of their narrative. There are many fans who don't think the Sister Wise kids will agree. Similarly, some simply believe it to be a horrible concept in general. Could Leon and Maddie really pull it off? It seems like it would just be Tony and McKelty, with Gwen and Payden making frequent cameos, and none of those people can be trusted. You wouldn't want to scoot from the people who would do it. The Payden and McKelty concert, that is. To be honest, I hope that all they do at this point to raise awareness of the difficulties is a long episode discussing Garrison's life and how they are doing six or twelve months later. That's it after that. Nothing more. Give Cody and Robin the money and narc line and allow the other wise to move on and dismantle. I thought Maddie was attempting a lot to become an influencer before she had Joey. She was genuinely trying to promote this ideal existence through professionally prepared images. I'm not sure if she would want it today, though. Leon most certainly isn't, just like Logan and Aspen. What are your thoughts on a Sister Wives spin-off that centers on the kids? Would you like to see more of the show's episodes? What do you hope happens to the television show? Comment Family below to carry Mary discussion. Brown reflected on her marriage and divorce from Kobe Brown in a thoughtful post on their walled, the 34th marriage anniversary on Sunday, April 21. So I considered moment whether or not I wanted to address this, and I've decided I will. The TLC personality, 53, began in a lengthy caption alongside a print of herself and her canine. 34 times ago moment, I got married. 34 times ago was the launch of this family that so numerous of you have come to love, or, well, not so important. Yes, I know sharp well that we're a veritably polarizing content. Mary added that when she married Cody, 55, she'd no way anticipated that she'd one day get disassociated. Still, she does not remorse the marriage, nor does she lament their split. I look back on the times and see where I could have done better, where I did the stylish I could, where I didn't live to my stylish eventuality, and where I loved as full as my heart could feel it, she continued. I look back and am thankful for the jests and the assignments. The mama of one admitted that she formerly believed she was a failure if she couldn't make my marriage work. Still, she flipped the narrative and decided that everything she learned only made her stronger. Not a failure, but a strong woman going after her dreams. Not a failure, but a woman realizing dreams that she didn't know she indeed had. Not a failure, but a woman erecting her own table and girding it with people who want to partake it with her, she wrote. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.